Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here, and thank you guys so much for tuning back into Max That Rush. And guys, today is going to be a really, really big day. Um, I, I'm always excited about doing Max That Rush. We only do them once a week, and today I'm going to try to get this king upgraded to level 36. That's the goal. We need 149,000 Dark Luke, so I've got 142,000. That means we need a, a little bit of Dark Elixir today. My laboratory is still rolling. Those hounds are doing a great job, so keep going, guys. You're doing, you're doing great. So, before we actually show something, I actually look through my attack log and check out this attack, guys. Dan Deman has over 7 thousand dark elixir again this is a replay but it was a few days ago but i didn't want to lose the replay seven thousand dark elixir is just stupid like that's just ridiculous amounts of loot so check it out drawing the funnel i went ahead and did a little bit of a left a little bit of a right funnel and sending the majority of my dark elixir up through or not my dark elixir my dark elixir grabbing troops my miners up through the base guys and taking out first these drills we've already got two drills that's 2700 dark elixir the third one is there that dark elixir is in the core but what we're mostly worried about is trying to get those heroes down which actually happened super easy because they came together into the same poison spell so i was like bro GG, you know, I've got one more um, heal spell. I went ahead and dropped it on the middle of this Dark Elixir storage. We've got a lot of miners on the left-hand side as well. And no heroes. Like, th that's what's... I think that's what's most impressive about this particular attack. But also, what's most impressive about this strategy as a whole is that you don't have to have your heroes. Like... 10 on 10 farming, especially if you're trying to get Dark Elixir, is so easy because of this reason, is that you don't need a Queen Walk. You don't need anything like that. All you need is Miners. Now, I've already got 6,450 Dark Elixir, and there's 600 sitting in this Town Hall that I wasn't able to get. I mean, I came from the wrong side of the base to get the Town Hall, but I'm happy. 6,450 Dark Elixir plus my Master League loot bonus. I mean, you're talking about 7 thousand dark elixir right off the bat in this video and um really been it's been amazing guys the loot all around i mean if you're watching any of my series any of the three or four that i'm doing right now then you're seeing just massive loot grabs day after day after day and it has been absolutely incredible guys if you're seeing streams the loot is incredible during those streams be sure if you have not done so already hit that subscribe button join the class family turn on notifications to be able to check in on these videos the first minute they're live and of course the live streams but yes guys 6450 dark elixir plus the loot bonus and then not only was the dark elixir amazing in this attack guys but the elixir and gold was too i mean you're talking about just a ridiculous find guys and if i had went out and attacked before showing you the replay so I'll show you again it's at the bottom it's at the bottom so i would have lost that replay all the other attacks i mean 3000 3000 3000 3000 3000 444 4, 4. i mean lots of dark elixir being grabbed but for now let's go find us a Dark Elixir base. Again, we need 149,000 Dark Elixir, and I have 142, so that means that we technically need like 3,000, 3,500, give or take, per raid. Um, and we've only got two raids because I'm not boosted. So I've got to find the perfect base for you guys so that we make that deadline. I'll be back with you guys once I do. Yo, guys. Oh, my goodness. 6,900 Dark Elixir. Plus, we got a lot of Golden Elixir, over 700,000 of each um, i mean that that's insane but look guys we got a problem all every drop of dark elixir is in the core now fortunately miners are a decent core diving army but it might be a little bit dicey it might be just a little bit dicey so let's see where the queen the queen's over here where's the king king's down here okay i say we fight fire with fire here guys i say we put the queen on this side and we get the king on this side and we wait just a minute we gotta wait just a minute i actually I'm, I'm worried about something the queen i want the queen to dive in to get the enemy queen but i'm afraid she's gonna start walking around to, like try to get this elixir collector so let's see what she's gonna do oh she's gonna go the other way perfect all right let's pop that king's ability early and let's get all these miners to go straight in also my queen's dying oh blast <laughs> Queen's dying. That's never good. That's not good at all. Um, let's drop the poison over this queen. Let's get some early heals. Oh, man. We've got to get a good core die, guys. If we don't get all these miners in the core, we're not going to get this dark elixir. And that would just be sad. I mean, that would just be sad. So let's just see, guys. Miners are doing good. The queen is actually getting the work done over there. King died, but the queen did not. 
So maybe the queen will be able to funnel our miners in through the core. That would be just awesome, wouldn't it? Let's drop another heal. We've got to keep these guys alive. These are the ones that are going to get the work done. We've already got one drill. We've got the second drill. Now we need that storage and we need that other drill. We've got the town hall as well, guys. This might be a 100% dark elixir grab. Actually, I'm pretty confident that it will be, guys. Come on. Yes, guys. Amazing loot grab by my miners. I was worried. I mean, it's like a big old ring base. I wasn't sure if we we're going to get the funnel, but it worked out. Uh, deploying the miners evenly across the side like that, they're able to get some on the edges and keep everything just going straight, and that's exactly what happened. So there you go, guys. We didn't get all the golden elixir, but we got 100% of the dark elixir for a total grab of almost exactly 7,500 dark elixir, and that's actually all that we needed for the video, but I've got another attack ready. Don't worry. I'm not going to shortchange you, but there you go. 750,000 gold. 730,000 elixir and 7,500 dark elixir. That was an amazing grab. And I don't know if you saw that, but it was a 69% total grab. You know what? That deserves celebration. All right, that deserves a celebration. Let's let's go out and let's find another base, guys. I've got no heroes this time. I don't have all I don't have full spells. All I've got is miners and a heal. We better find an easy base, guys. But I want to still get the minimum 3,000. It would be great to get even more than that Dark Elixir. Uh, but we'll just see what the bases offer me. So let me find something else. Probably won't be as epic, but it could be more epic. You never know. Oh, my goodness, guys. I was about to quit searching. I was searching forever to try to find the ideal base. And I think I just found it. 6,500 Dark Elixir. 655,000 Golden Elixir. And I've only got one heal, so this may be a bit tricky. Um, it's gonna be tricky. Um, let me let me actually. Okay, here's how we're gonna do this. We're gonna go one, two, three. That's gonna be twelve, and I'm gonna heal over these miners because they're gonna heal deal with the enemy queen, and they're gonna get a drill. After I get that down, and that'll be done. That's all the heals that I've got. Um, the rest of the dark elixir kind of hangs out over here. So let's go. Let's take out this bomb tower. All right, kind of split them up that way. Not all of them are affected by the splash damage, though there is death damage and it's terrible. Um, and then let's take out a few corner buildings. Basically, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to dive troops in. Oh, there's oh there's a dragon. No, 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 no. Get the miners in. Okay, there's a dragon. Um, guys, we're probably not going to get this storage. <laughs> we're probably about to die. All the troops. All the troops. Oh man. Who brings a freaking dragon to the to the Who does this? Alright, I'm so upset right now, man. Come on, come on, come on, miners. Come on, you can do this. Just just jump up and hit him with your your your, your shovel. Darn it! Okay, well, you know what? That's what we get for attacking with only one spell. Uh, if I had a poison spell, it would have been not so bad. So Kind of a bummer, guys. That would have went so much better with all my spells, my heroes and stuff. But hey, we knew it was a gamble attacking without our stuff. We still got 3,500 Dark Elixir. That's great. And we've got more than we needed for the goal. So I guess at the end of the day, that is going to have to be okay. So let's hop over to our progress base and have a look, see what's going on. Let's see what's going on here. We got ourselves all of our Archer Towers are now either max or one level for max or upgrading to that point so that's good we got half our cannons in the same position we got one more bomb tower and all four mortars so the kind of the goal right now is getting all these cannons done and then start maxing out our archer towers also i have a book of uh, uh building and that's going to be spent on the most expensive like the longest time upgrade and i believe it's the bomb tower for seven days i think we also did that in a previous video but yeah this is five days so i have a Book of uh, book of building. I do have it here. Yep, there's my book of building, but I don't have enough gold to upgrade the bomb tower, so I might do that off camera. We'll just have to see. But right now, the focus is going to be the gold. Obviously, we want to upgrade another defense. We can afford it. We might as well do it. But before we do that, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade my king. That is a 149,000 dark elixir upgrade. Only a six day upgrade, guys. It's so it's so nice. But we're going to only have four upgrades left to my heroes before we're done with his heroes guys max out rush making insane progress let's do this in three two one bam and then of course guys we've got a book of heroes let's spin it let's use it let's get it over with so that we don't have to stop warring in fact i'm in preparation day for the current war so i can't leave my king down i've got to have him for the war for the attacks so let's go guys in three two one bam 
And there we go, guys. Level 36 King. That is amazing. And now let's upgrade a defense. But before we do that, we have to spend our elixir. Why not? Why not? Let's just do it. Let's spend it. Let's go. Let's do uh let's do three walls. That's gonna be six million elixir and three, two, one, bam. There we go. And then we can use our fifth builder since my next builder will come available in two and a half hours. No big deal. So let's upgrade this cannon, guys. 4.5 million gold in three, two, one, bam. And there we have it, guys. Oh, man, the progress is amazing. Our defenses are going down very, very quickly. Our king only has four levels to go. And honestly, there is just not very much left in the laboratory. I mean, besides the hound that's going right now, the only troop is the minions. And then it's all dark spells. And then we're done with the Tunnel 10 lab, which is just freaking insane. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Guys, progress has been awesome. So, guys, thank you all so much for tuning in to this episode of Max Ad Rush. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button if you have not done so already for daily gaming videos. And like this video if you liked it. I mean, the likes do mean a lot. I do look at them. It helps me to know what you guys are enjoying. And um, that's it for me. Thank you all so much for tuning in. And I love each and every one of you. And I will see you all again next time.